Okay, now I'll show you how to download Falcon, the software management tool for the ISAT Doc uh, 1 or 2 range of products. This uh, The Falcon tool can also be used with the Terra and Oceana series of products uh, for, from Beam Communications. So first thing you need to do is log into the Beam Communications website. That would be www.beamcommunications.com and um, there's two ways to get to uh, the software management tool first if you you can do a search for Falcon as shown and if you scroll down now you can see that there's Falcon 2.3 software management tool now you can do click that and automatically that will download a file or alternatively you can go to the product page if you have the ISAT Doc 2 Marine, what I'll do is I went to the product page and I'll just scroll down for the ISAT Doc 2 Marine. It's a product right here. And I'll go click View Product. And this first landing page is your product page. So you can see the pricing, you can see the specs. What you need to do to get to the software management tool is to go to the product support page. You click that. And once you're in this page, you need to click the configurations tab. So you have five tabs here. You have the frequently asked questions, manuals and guides, configuration, compliance, and remote common resources. Falcon is in the configuration. That means you can use a Falcon tool to configure the docking station or the terminal. And you can click this download link here. Okay. If you want to read the release notes, you can download that file here. So if I click that, it will do the same. Download the software management tool. Now what I'll do next is open this uh, downloaded file. Here you can see. Click on that. And what I'll do is I'll install the software management tool. So I'll show you what's going on in real time click agree and next you can choose whichever doesn't matter and click next said yes to it and then that's done and what I'll do next is search for Falcon and what uh, docking station I have at the moment is I have an ISAT Dock 2 Marine connected into my computer through the USB port. See the Falcon configuration tool? Next thing you need to do is click connect. Okay, Make sure that your docking station is switched on and connected to your PC. So what you can see in the so Falcon software management tool is you have uh, buttons for the other features and options and the unit status and unit information so you have the model number ISAT Doc 2 Marine you have the terminal firmware you have the ISAT Phone Pro 2 firmware you have the input voltage provided by into the docking station this is the PCB model or revision number the serial number of the docking station the temperature inside the dock and this is the IME number of the handset and this is the signal level that means our antenna is not connected so these options here uh, are you can click and explore what you can do this is if you want to uh, configure the pots or the RJ11 interface this button here for SMS uh, you can uh, type in and send SMS and read SMS as well in this interface. You can see that. And here you can configure power settings. That means you can enable disable sleep mode. At the moment this is disabled for the ISAT Duck 2 Marine because the power supply we've used is an AC plug pack. An AC plug pack would uh, disable the sleep mode. Okay, and backup and restore uh, features. Advanced options. Uh, most importantly, you can do a firmware upgrade. So the current firmware is 2.0, the new firmware is 2.0, that means your docking station is up to date and no need to do that. 
If it was different, then you can just click start and a firmware update will automatically just uh, proceed. There's no need for you to do that now, I'll just click cancel. So this is your Falcon with ISAT Dock 2 Marine. Now the interface will be the same for ISAT Dock 2 Lite, Drive, and Pro. It will be the same interface for the ISAT uh, Dock 1 range of docking stations and for the Terra and Oceana 800 series. Okay. Now if you need help for this uh, Falcon, you can click this uh, red uh, question mark and when it will open um, a user manual for the Falcon software management tool okay so we don't need to do that now but I'll just disconnect that and there you go that's your Falcon configuration or software management tool